in large image House Democratic impeachment managers, from left, House Judiciary Committee Chairman Jerry Nedler, DNY, Representative Sylvia Garcia, D. Texas, Rep. Hakeem Jeffries, DNY, House Intelligence Committee Chairman Adam Schiff, D. Califf, and Rep. The Demings, D. Florida. AP How do you say hypocrisy in Ukrainian? Republicans are crying foul as the Senate impeachment trial of President Trump grinds on, calling out House impeachment managers for their own shifting positions on Ukrainian military aid. The Democratic House managers' hypocrisy is on full display, they've spent most of their time lecturing the Senate on aid to Ukraine, yet four of them voted against legislation that provided the very same aid they're lecturing us on. Iowa Sen Joni Ernst said in a fiery tweet, The impeachment case centers on the accusation that President Trump withheld $319 million in military to Ukraine. The point was also repeated by Oklahoma Republican Sen. Jim Inhofe during an interview on Fox News Saturday. The Democratic House manager's hypocrisy is on full display, they've spent most of their time lecturing the Senate on aid to Ukraine, yet four of them voted against legislation that provided the very same aid they're lecturing us on. Joni Ernst at Sen Joni Ernst January 24, 2020 and 2018, reps. Jerry Nedler, Zoe Lofgren, Sylvia Garcia and Hakeem Jeffries all voted against that year's National Defense Authorization Act, which included $250 million in aid for Ukraine. Nedler voted against the NDAA again a year later, and an additional $300 million in aid, according to the White House. Democrat House impeachment managers keep talking about Ukraine security assistance. Did they mention they voted no on that assistance? Nadler voted no on FY20 NDA, included $300 million for Ukraine. Nadler, Lofgren. The White House at White House January 24, 2020, they voted in opposition of the U.S. providing defensive security system to Ukraine, said New York Rep. Elise Stefanik. Share this, let's block ads. Why? 